Okay, everyone, welcome to this Living World Season 5 Ice Breed Saga. Um, Champions Chapter, we are given exclusive accents, access once again. Thank you to ArenaNet. And we have things to do, and we're just going to get started right away. We have Episode 5, Champions. Rallying their allies, the commander defends Tyria from the march of two dragons in the thrilling climax of the Ice Brood Saga. Play this episode. See if there's any voice acting. Oh, there's a letter. There's a letter. Talking with Jormag. Hey, Commander. I'm headed to the Eye of the North with Bram. For a while now, he's been working up the nerve to have a talk with Jormag. Not sure why he asked me to come along. Handholding's uh, more your thing. But I won't say no to a friend. Just so you know, in case you wanted to join, Ritlock. Okay, so we have to go to Eye of the North. And conveniently, we are here in Eye of the North. So there are, I do see a couple new merchants and so on and so forth. But we have matters to attend to, specifically the step known as Primordis Rising. Meet with Aureen at the Eye of the North. We're here. Hi, Aureen. It's another Elder Dragon, right? A oh, voice acting! I, those before. I mean, this one ought to be scared of me. Ah, uh, sure. Oh, good. The commander. Redlock? Brandon. Fine. I'm fine. Yeah. He's been helping us clean up the last of the Dominion. They've gone pretty quiet. Word got around about Bangar. They mostly fell apart. The ones who didn't, well, Imperator Stoneglow's no pushover. Still no Ryland sightings, I take it? No Frost Legion, no Ice Dragon, and yeah, no whatever Ryland is. I'm not the only one with a bad feeling about that, right? Jormag's spoken through Bangar a few times now. Hasn't said much. Well, I'm in the mood for answers. Let's get some. My friends, you felt oh, too. Ah, Aurene! The stirrings deep beneath us. Earthquakes erupting all over Tyria. So the Crystal Bloom have told me. Jormag. I don't believe it is. But something is moving. Something's coming. But not the Elder Dragon. The older you get, the more I think you enjoy sounding ominous. I am an Elder Dragon, after all. Oh. Hey, Oreen so said, I have credits now. I have credentials. They can't hear anything in my presence, unless I allow it. Now might be the time. Bram has some issues to work through. Oh, the Norn. You honestly think Jormag's gonna tell you anything you don't already know? Glorified megaphone. But you still love hearing yourself talk. Voice acting you know is so nice. When you don't fight it. Take a breath. Jormag. Jormag! I am Bram Arison. I've come to speak with you. Ori. Ah. You're amassing your warriors. They won't be any use. You mean, against the Earthquakes? Mm, my brother is incapable of subtlety. He stirs, and when he awakens, oh, it will not be with the same grace as I. Grace? You corrupted spirits with your evil, and acted out crimes for thousands of years. I have a will to live, and a right. If that is a crime, no one is innocent. Do not presume to know me. But I do. I know exactly what you are. I was raised on the stories and the prophecies. Mortals. Clinging to superstitions to give your brief lives meaning. I'm loving this so much. You are not invincible. And so emotional. Aureen, you will never reach your potential if you surround yourself with beings like these. And reach it you must, for the sake of us all. The time has come to end my orders. That's not my role. The balance can still be maintained. The balance 
is a fantasy. Another mortal superstition. Primordus will lay waste to this world. And you are not ready. Damn! Um, hey, Commander, are you busy right now? I mean, what is it, Timey? Well, we've been monitoring Mithrifts and ley lines, keeping an eye out for Jormac like you asked. Haven't found Jormac, but we have found... Easier to show you the data. Could you come to Radisoom? I know I've had enough pompous dragon speaking through a pompous has-been for one day. It's so good, though. You should definitely come too. Soon. Go, champion. Maybe Timey can offer some clarity. Okay, now we gotta go to Radisoom. I've been kind of calling that Jormak isn't the real enemy. I mean, I was talking about this in a live stream just yesterday, that... Jormag is just an entity trying to protect themselves. And I can't really, like, knock that because we're doing it. And I think Jormag is just amassing an army to defend themselves once Primordus wakes up. And it seems to be that Jormag is at least portraying that as such. And, um, I still want Jormag to be a malicious, eerie, creepy character. But I also said this yesterday in a live stream that I don't want any of the dragons to end up being killed off um, in this. But we'll have to see. We'll have to see what happens with Primordus and Jormag and their relationship. That a human going to Divinity's Reach ended up in Black Citadel. Can you imagine wow, that's awkward. <laughs> okay, time to go speak with Tiny. Oh, Quark? What's Quark? Your claims with the Dockmaster in person. This is ridiculous. You do realize... Take it up with a council member, once you've collected your freight. See if I won't! <sighs> Finally, Commander! Everything okay? According to the Arcane Council, the sanctity of independent research is superseded by other priorities. Timey's out at the Advanced Metamystics Lab. I'll get you to the gate, but then I have to cut through some pernicious red tape. Mm, we love that red tape stuff. Okay, let us head on over to Rotasum. Probably we're going to the... Are we going to the Arcane Council right now? Is that where we're headed? Where are we headed? Tell me the Dan Blue. Frost Legion. Oh. Apparently the Arcane Council invited oh. them. And Ryland. What? You could have led with that. Uh. Ah, the Pact Commander. Welcome. <gasps> we could see his model. To hear Timmy's findings as well. Do you have any idea who you've led in here? What he's done? Ryland Steelcatcher, champion of Jormag. He commands the Ice Dragon's forces. We've been looking everywhere for you. The Asura just don't give any qualms. Done is done, Commander. The Arcane Council deals in the present and the future. Jormag is awake. Yeah, because of him. Which I love the Asura stuff. Will not be far <gasps> Primordus, of course the Asura are doing this stuff. Alliance is logical. I'd think the Pact Commander would recognize the value of this arrangement. You would think. The Asura have studied Primordus for ages. Yes! Not to seek their knowledge. And Jormag's no fool. Oh, sure. As Elder Dragons go, Jormag's pretty reasonable. Exactly. Jormag and I keep our word. When Primordus rises, we will erase him out of existence. And since we're all playing nice, how about you return my bow? You know, the one you stole? Now why would I hand you a weapon you think can hurt Jormag? Act first, think later, right? What? I mean... Don't worry. I'll keep it safe for you. Oh, I'm getting it back. Beat him! Grab Beat him up! <laughs> Why don't you help Gorik with his delivery on the docks? Ritlock and I can handle this. Sure. Why not? Well, this is quite interesting. Um... But I'm a merchant. It's quite... Okay, Counselor Vark and Counselor Zudo. I didn't even think of the Asura being a, a major part in this, but I guess they were shown in the trailer. I just thought that... I didn't really make the connection that, like, of course they would be here, because Primordus. And I love just being in Radasum. I I miss it. I wish that we used it more often. And not just Tiny, but, like, everyone. Oh, I see some really interesting golems in the background. Primordus Rising. I hope you get new, like, Gollum models. That's a beautiful artwork. 
That is beautiful artwork. Oh, we're walking. Compliance, huh? What happened to your char above all crap? Oh, now you want to talk to me instead of just shouting my name. Oh, damn. <laughs> Spend some time with your mag. I see the bigger picture now. Everyone has a role to play. Oh, this is quite interesting. Um, oh, hello, Timey. Long time no see. I won't have to go through this twice. I've been tracking the quakes. Needles all over the place. Way more than ordinary tectonic movement. Can you tell if it's Primordis? Some readings mimic Primordis' signature. Some may be lay energy. And I still haven't figured out this spike. That can't be right. We've never seen activity this far below the crust. So many blips literally all over the map, like bodies burrowing up. And where exactly can we expect these bodies to surface? <laughs> She's like right outside. Can't we? I mean, just look at this. Gates of flame. Ooh. Spikes of energy resembling Primordius's signature have been observed in this area. Delgemor Garrison. Oh, we're going back to like oh the death Bale, uh Beldem's rise. How long Energy spike detected. What? Oh no. Oh. Very, very not good. oh no! Yay, we get to actually fight in Radasum. How very interesting. Oh, and the music is good too. Keep him out of the lab. Earthquakes. Watch your back, oh no, we have to defend the lab. Okay, let's let's do some destroying. Let's, oh, see what I did there? Destroying of destroyers. Very funny. Quality memes. This guy is using some projectiles, so let's let's kill some of the projectiles he's throwing. What's with the ice? I didn't catch that part. We got that. Oh, these are, I guess, I guess are the orbs that we can collect? That's a part of the mastery, I believe. Gotta jump. Harder to kill than last time. Not really. They seem bigger than I remember. Meaner too. Help! Horik, up the ramp. Go, go. Oh wait. Us, Bram. Destroyer problem on the docks. Could use some hands. Oh, we gotta go to the docks. One sec. Got it. I programmed the gate for a one-way trip harbor side. Great. Let's, Let's go. <laughs> easy, easy and convenient. Let's keep it going. Oh, is there an achievement? Qualify. Probably just finishing this in a time limit. Oh. I guess these destroyers seem kind of bigger. Maybe? Maybe that's just like a placebo. Oh. Wait, Frost Legion? The people that we were just killing are now helping us? This is very strange. It's kind of like Mordrum suddenly becoming like allies. But it is kind of cool seeing everyone together. Despite how strange it might be do we oh yeah let's go, let's go over here let's, let's head on over here they have boons i recognize that they have quickness and what seems to be swiftness and something so maybe spellbreakers will get a little bit of use out of this <laughs> uh oh destroys over here okay oh timey's here is she actually fighting doesn't seem like she is. She might be kind of bugged out a little bit. Let's go. Ah. These are some like interesting areas that you don't often see. Spin to win. I guess these veterans might be a little bit more tanky. Oh. Oh, it's Flax. Some of these other iconic Asurin characters. Where to? Where to? What's next? Oh, now we get to go down here. Oh, crispy fur. 
His fur is so soft, we must keep it that way. But I kind of like that we're not seeing Destroyer, um, that our Death Touched or Vine Touched. I kind of didn't super like that. I mean, maybe for like one or two like unique mob bosses or just mobs in general. But I like fighting like the, the original Destroyers. Oh no, are they downed? Wait, what, what? What is this? What is this mechanic that we see here? Actually, they seem to have quite a decent chunk of health. What is this? Oh, do we just stand in place to revive them? That's a new thing that they're doing, kind of. Um, it didn't seem to work while in Death Shroud, which might need to be ironed out, but interesting nonetheless. Ooh, they explode. Swift cleanup. Oh, quite an interesting, like, Primordus Jormag. I was expecting you to have my back. You dying doesn't help us kill Primordus, Commander. You honestly expect us to believe this Alliance stuff? Why not? It doesn't really matter what you believe, does it? Where did these destroyers even come from? One minute we're checking crates, and the next they're bubbling up from the water. Never seen. Jamie, move! Oh, Ember Knight. It's kind of, um, I, I guess we've seen these models before. Wow, they are running. What? I wonder why they just ran up here. Oh, all the um counselors. Oh, my God. Did you seriously just throw me into the water? Nice model, though. I think we see it a couple times in other areas, but I want to see some, like, crazy cool destroyer models. This specimen differs wildly from archival accounts of destroyers. Also, it's gigantic. Gigantic. Creatures. Catalog the evolutionary oh. discrepancies. Identify any weaknesses. Let's Are they up there? Resources. If oh. I can isolate a clearer signature, we can pinpoint when and where they'll show up. I'd like to leave a small force in your city to wait for any information and to protect our- A Frost Legion? No. Asura are more than capable of guarding our city. Get him. Get him, Counselor. For the gesture and the alliance. When Primordus is destroyed, Jormag will see your former home restored to you. Ew, I don't like that. I promise that. Mm -mm. I don't trust that. I'm the champion of Jormag. We need to spread the word. Any place that's felt even the slightest tremor, they've got to prepare. I'm heading up to Kresha. I'll pass the word on my way. Might want to put the crystal bloom on it, too. I'm gonna stay here. Keep an eye on things for a bit. Thanks, Bram. I can always count on you, Bram. Okay, Primordus Rising completed. A very energetic start to the, the champion's finale. Next, we have to travel to the Eye of the North and share your experience with Ori.